Greetings guys and gals, this is Jabrock being you the best in esports, and this is going to be a really sad video for me. Um, it's kind of an announcement video, slash channel update, slash farewell, yes, uh, I did say farewell. Um, I'm actually going to take a leave of absence from casting and probably my YouTube channel altogether, because what it's come down to is school and uh, CSL and my personal StarCraft goals, I guess you could say, are really taking a toll on me as well as casting and um, it's just like I can't do them all, I can't work out, I can't play intramural basketball and try to be, try to qualify for tournaments and try to cast all these games and try to be a caster and keep up with my GPA and all of that stuff and I know I, I might have repeated some stuff in there but I, I just can't do all of that stuff anymore um, and something's gotta give and my priorities are school and my body and then my career as a gamer and it just comes down to the fact that casting kinda comes last in that category and I kind of strayed away lately from the caster that I've wanted to be. I've always wanted to be this enthusiastic guy who uh, brings really entertaining stuff to the table and is always positive, always enthused, always takes criticism well. But just the stress and a bunch of other factors. Um, I know you guys saw that Combat X game. And some of the comments I've been getting have really kind of hit me a little bit more than others. Um, I've kind of been fed up with it, and that's due to stress, not necessarily due to you guys. I know all of you guys just want to help me out, all uh, 394 of you guys, which is awesome. I picked up two new subs today, and I, I'm, like, thinking about that now. I'm like, these guys just subbed to me, and I'm not going to be putting out videos anymore. It's kind of a weird thing, and I told you guys that I would definitely tell you when the time came that I would um, stop casting, pretty much. And I'm not going to say I'm never going to cast again, but as of now, this is, like, an indefinite thing where... I don't know when I'll be back and I don't know if I'll ever be back and I always said that if the StarCraft uh, world was better off without me that I would be the first one to be like yeah I'm gonna step down and leave and it seems like there's so many casters these days so many guys that are better than me that you guys can listen to I know Deja Vu starting up his uh, winners league stuff and the pro league stuff so you can go hit up him for anything like that. Nuke's got the uh, OSL covered and Ranchin's got the MSL covered and you see Husky and HD have the Shoutcast. Day9 has the advice video so there's a bunch of guys out there. Seabiscuit um, I think his name's Seabiscuit. No it's not Seabiscuit that's a horse. Um, it's like Total Biscuit. <laughs> oh geez. Yeah Seabiscuit's the horse. But there's state of the game podcast there's um all that stuff and so i'm just i'm just going to have to leave you guys i mean definitely hit me up on twitter i'll still be on twitter i'll still be on facebook i'll still be on se2 i still play with you guys on brood war it's just that the casting part of my starcraft career i guess is kind of over as of now i'm not like i said i'm not saying it's forever but that's kind of what it's looking like because I just can't keep up with everything and I really kind of want to make a shot now that they've announced the uh, NASL to kind of work towards that and possibly qualify for that maybe not this year not maybe not next year but sometime in the near future um, and try to make some money off of these tournaments and I know you guys are going to be like you're a diamond player man like anyone could be a diamond player you've got no real skill and yeah, that's true, but I've always believed that you should go and follow your dreams and chase your goals. And if you work hard enough at something, then it, it'll pay off for you in the end. And that, that I just have to believe that right now. And um, part of doing that is kind of focusing on it a little bit more than I have been. And so the extra time that I'm not casting, I could be doing homework. Or the extra time I'm not casting, I could be doing playing a few ladder matches. Um, and it does take a long time to upload these videos, you know, it does take probably like an hour, hour and a half at least for only like a nine minute video. It takes about that long with casting and re uh, rendering the video, buffering it and everything. And so it is a huge chunk out of my day that I take out <clears throat> every day. And um, it's kind of disappointing because I just got fraps. I just got the Adobe uh, premium production package and all that stuff. And it was expensive and my parents got it for me. And... 
for a lot of this time, I didn't want to disappoint them and be like, yeah, I just wasted your money, and I wasted my money. But at the same time, it'll allow me to do other stuff. Like, I can still make intros for people. I can still make uh, live-action movies. And so I'll have that. And then if I ever did want to screen cap anything, I could definitely do that as well. So it's not a total waste of money. It's just kind of a letdown that I would have chose to have such a short career, I guess. And my channel has grown pretty big. I mean, I started in August. And uh, I'm up to like almost 400 subs which is pretty big for me it was you know it's just been a terrific ride with you guys you guys have been all awesome um especially those of who comment on almost every one of my videos i definitely know who you guys are uh i'd give you all shout outs i don't want to mess your name uh up your names and i don't want to forget anyone but you know all you guys have definitely definitely changed how i view the starcraft community and pretty much shape this goal that I've had. I've been like, you know, there are people out there that love what I love, and we can all together make this a big thing, and I think that's a very important dream to have and a goal to have. And I want eSports one day to become really, really big, and, um, you know, my doing my commentaries was a, a little bit of a part of that and trying to pursue that goal, but now I have to do something for myself uh, as a personal goal and that's to try to become a professional gamer and so that's what I'm gonna try to do and it's just that like I said doing the cast just takes a little bit too much out of my day and uh, I was gonna say something else also oh yeah and so back to what I was saying I used to be the commentator that wanted to be enthusiastic really happy all the time not stressed not complaining and I've been listening to my commentaries and a lot of them lately have been like me complaining about matchups or me complaining about builds or me complaining about what other people say and that's all due to stress and if I'm not gonna be the commentator that I've set out to be and the one that I wanted to be at the beginning and I haven't been replying to comments as much as on my videos then I don't want to I don't want to do it I don't want to do something that's half-assed or or not the the final product that I want it to be I want it to be professional enthusiastic lively and if I'm not going to be able to bring that then I don't want to do it at all I don't want to do something 90% I don't want to do something 20% or 99% I want it to be 100% every time and I just can't do that anymore so I really apologize to you guys but I hope that you guys understand where I'm coming from and so you guys can uns up, un <laughs> unsub to my channel or stay subbed in case I do decide to put something else up um, I'm also going to end the back to reality podcasts because those I mean they did kind of take off a little bit but I just can't keep up with it I really have to focus now on school and like I said trying to pursue this goal of being a professional gamer so I'm just going to start playing more tournaments and feel free to twitter me or tweet me i guess or uh hit me up on facebook and i'll definitely talk with you guys because i have time for that i just don't have time to upload videos all the time and so i'm gonna stop csl casting like all my casting stuff's done i'm not just i'm not switching over to starcraft 2 or anything this isn't against brood war it's just casting in general is just taking way too much time so i hope you guys really kind of understand where i'm coming from and support me in this um comment below on what you guys think and that's going to be it for me. Um, try to keep you guys updated on the Twitter about what I'm up to. But other than that, probably not be on YouTube all that much. Lates.